Hey guys, Mom's Kirby OK here today, bringing you a gameplay. Oh, and this isn't any um, other original gameplay. Today I'm going to be showing you two videos, and after those two videos, we're going to be talking about Modern Warfare 3. And then we, meanwhile, we're going to be talking about my day, or the topic to, is going to be my uh, today's topic is going to be my day. Um, I'm going to try not to mention Modern Warfare 3 as much as I want to. Um, so, my day was pretty much great here, um, but, uh, we have this Russian kid, and you know all you guys know I'm German, but I'm not, I don't have problems with Russians at all. Um, but, he does not, he just doesn't want to shut up. <laughs> and, um, so, I'm going to be a minute here, I'm going to say, I said a couple crap stuff back, but, uh, he just doesn't, you know, he doesn't, doesn't want to shut up. And, um, I hand it to him, so he blocks me on Facebook, which is, in what he was calling me, I'm gonna say he's calling me a pussy, and yeah, I know I cursed right there, but, um, um, I said, you are being a, it, I mean, it's so I ironic for him to call me that, when he, uh, blocks me on Facebook, which is, you know, kind of funny, to be honest with you, but, um, um, I, I was really, I was laughing. I mean, I'm being honest here. I was laughing hard, uh, when he said that. So, um, uh, he, um, um, he actually came to my house today, and I don't know how he knew where I lived. Apparently one of his butt buddies told him, and he wanted to fight me. And my answer, I said, um, there's no need to fight since we are doing... You say, I mean, the, this all started, I forgot, to, this all started uh, with um, him trying to trip me on the bus and crap. Um, uh, he, I said, you know, we throw crap at each other, you have no right to fight me. And the reason you only only want to fight is because you're running out of words. And that it, all you get listeners out there, if somebody fights you after an argument, they're just out of words and can't do anything else, but they have to use their fists to prove that they're better than you. Which honestly is kind of sad because I don't have enough logic or anything to uh, actually, you know, beat you out with words. But you know, using words is kind of like you know, wimpish. But um, he ran out of words, and uh, you know, people that run out of words, they have to fight to get their point across. And uh, I've heard all those uh, words in the book, so I know all those curse words, and. Uh, they don't really offend me at all because it just makes you look stupid when you say them. You 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 can look cool when you curse, but um, my school is a, a bully free school, which is really nice. But uh, again, people get away with it sometimes. I don't care. I don't care about him. But here's the funny part. This is where the irony kicks. And he comes over to my house. Um, but you know, I have my phone in my pocket, and uh. The funny part is, uh, he, um, um, he actually, he actually stayed there, and when he saw me pull my phone out, he thought I was going to call the cops on him. Well, no, I'm not that chicken. I'm not going to do that. I'm going to take a picture of it and prove it to the cops that he was there. <laughs> I'm not going to call and, you know, not prove it, because it seems in this world now everybody has to have proof of something happening, which I don't blame it, because, uh, half the people that called cops are false. Well, I live in a good neighborhood. I live in a good, good city, good, um, a good state. Um, the only bad part of Oklahoma City is the southwestern part, um, and that is filled with Mexicans. No, I'm not being a nationalist or whatever you want to call it. Uh, I have, I'm fine with Mexicans. They're pretty cool. They're pretty cool. Um, I have a couple friends that are Mexican. They're really cool. But, uh, that is the worst side of town. I don't know why. And that is, I don't know why, I think there's more crimes, um, cause when my, uh, what happened, um, my, uh, this was, what, two weeks ago, my mom, uh, came in and told me that, uh, they went to Walmart in the southwestern side of Oklahoma City, and this pizza hut guy was delivering pizza to somebody at Walmart, I don't know why, but there was some, uh, uh dark skin colored guys, I'm not gonna say black, cause that would sound kinda racist, um, they were they were actually trying to uh, mug him, and um, 
the guy was uh, had pepper spray and says, "Get away, get away, get away." And uh, I honestly felt sorry for the guy that was trying to get mugged because those uh, guys could have guns and stuff. But um, and I think they went away. I'm not sure. I didn't hear the whole story. <laughs> uh, there. There's not that much crimes here in Oklahoma, Oklahoma City. There's um, there's lots of tornadoes, um, lots of heat, lots of everything. It's a mixture of bipolar weather. Um, speaking of weather, uh, like uh, Oklahoma has the uh, has um uh, the reputation of having bipolar weather a lot, and um this year I don't think we're gonna have a fall. And, yeah, I know what you get. You probably are thinking, oh, everybody has a fall. Well, yeah, everybody has the season fall. But in Oklahoma, you can't really um, feel it because this uh, summer was so hot. What, 100 degrees every day? And it's still summer, but it gets cooler than that. Um, but uh, he, um, I mean... Now it's uh, cooling, it's somewhat cooling down, but that, when we have hot summers, that means we're going to have really bad winters, and I think we might have a 2011 ice storm, which is not, I don't care about ice storms, it's kind of cool to watch on TV, and, and then for the fact that you don't have any school, that's the even better part, but um, the bad part is that you don't have any power usually, because the uh, frozen ice just freezes on the power lines and takes power, la power out, that's a uh, yeah, when I grow up, I want to be a meteorologist. If you haven't seen on my uh, Facebook or uh, or on my YouTube channel, meteorologist is a weatherman. And uh, yeah, and the freezing rain I'm afraid of. I'm not afraid of any tornadoes or anything like that. Cause tornadoes, I mean, maybe if you lived in a what, mm, let's say, what state? Uh. We're going to say South Dakota, because there's not that much tornadoes to go through. There's some mountain, mountainous, or whatever you call it. But I'm not as, uh, I'm not afraid as, uh, you know, people are not used to tornadoes. Like, you know, Montana, you're never going to get tornadoes, because there's always, uh, there's always, uh, there's wind, uh, mountains blocking wind. Um, but uh, he, um, in Oklahoma, it's kind of normal to have tornadoes over the summer. Or any time of year, actually. It's possible to have a... Uh, tornadoes in winter, but it's really unlikely, because, um, I think it, I don't know why, I think there's not enough wind, I'm not gonna say that, though, because there's wind every season, especially in fall or summer, I mean, fall or spring, so we're more, um, more wind, windy, but, um, we have talked about enough about weather, um, let's see what we should talk about next, um, I really don't know. Modern Warfare 3 almost. Almost. Um, and if I might... Yeah, I'm going to be nice enough, and I'll show you the uh, the picture, a five-second picture, of the uh, kid that was um, on... Uh, that uh, decided to uh, come out of my house and try to uh, call the... Uh, just try to fight me. I'm going to plug in my SD card here real quick so I can show it to you guys. Alright, unplug that. Plug here. And, uh, it'll be like a less than a five second video. I mean, um, photo, so I can, uh, publish this on YouTube because it's over 15 minutes. I can't publish it. I don't know why. <clears throat> but, yeah, um, uh, in about 15, 20 seconds here, we're going to be talking about Modern Warfare 2. Hey, this is my gameplay. As soon as you see the Modern Warfare 3 screen pop up, then we're going to talk about it. We should be in about three, and you should be like this, ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, zero, bam, right here. Alright, this is popping up on my screen right about, um, now, here we go. Oh my god, um, apparently it's not popping up, so... Uh, I'm so sorry for the inconvenience right now. So, we're just gonna talk about it right now. Alright. Modern Warfare 3 confirmed crap. Alright. Confirmed. Uh, here, we're gonna start off with the maps. We're gonna have, we have Arcaden, which I think is based off of Berlin. I'm not sure. 
in Germany somewhere. Dome, which is in, uh, I think, America. Paris, which is in France. Underground, which is in, um, I don't know. <laughs> Village, which is in America, I think. Resistance, which I think is in America also. I'm not sure. Confirmed weapons here. Again, we're going to have lots of stuff to cover here. We're, okay, I did a podcast over this crap, so you know more of this on. M4A1 Carbine, the M16, the SCAR-L, the CM901, Type 95, G36C, ACR 6.8, MK14, AK47, FAD, and the FAMAS, which these are the assault rifles. Here we have our submachine guns, UMP45, which I heard was overpowered, MP5, PP90, M1, P90, PM9, MP7, MP5K, the AK-74U, and the Vector. And our light machine guns are the L86 SL LSW, MG36, PKP Peshenag, uh, I'm not Russian, sorry, M640, uh, MK46, M60, RPD, M240. And for sniper rifles, we have the Barrett 50 Cal, the L118A, which is a variance, uh, I think it's the uh, variance of the L96, it's the exact same thing it looks it's not based off uh, for uh, winter combat, though, like the only six of them. We have the Drugonov AS-50, which I believe is bolt action, like the intervention from Modern Warfare 2. The RSAS, yes, the RSAS, <laughs> RSASS, and the MSR. Shotguns, um, keep, please keep in mind, none of them are akimbo, as I am concerned here. And none of them are secondaries, they're all primaries. The o USAS, which is from South Korea. KSG-12. Spas 12, which I'm sure is from America. AA 12, which is American. The Striker, I don't know. And we got uh, Model 1887s. And I, hopefully they are more more um, balanced than they were in Modern Warfare 2. For all you guys played Modern Warfare 2. Um, the Machine Pistols, the FMG 9, MP5. Scorpion, which is the submachine gun, yes. And we have the Glock 18, G18. Handguns, USP 45. One second, guys. Um, uh, one second. Uh, alright, I'm back, guys. Sorry about that. Um, we will have the, uh, UMP, USP 45, the P99, which is the Wilder P99. I have the Airsoft, uh, that's one of my Airsoft ones to show, so if you want to check that out, it's in, like, one... 100 videos ago, <laughs> the MP4-12, the, the 44 Magnum, which I think is from World of War, I'm not sure, the 5.7, and the Desert Eagle. And our launchers are the Small, which is from Conduit 2, Javelin Missile from Modern Warfare 2, and the, well, the XM-25, M320, GLM, RPG-7, AT-4, um, all right, weapon proficiencies. These are what you do if you love your gun. You're gonna get to level up, so you can uh, level up and unlock all these crap. Kick, impact, attachments, which is like Warlord. Focus, breath, uh, st state, stability, range, melee, speed, damage. I'll not go into detail with those as they have been released, so you can look out over there for the videos. Attachments, red dot sight, suppressor, grenade launcher, rapid fire, ew, <laughs> grip, akimbo, tack knife, I love, a cog scope, ew, for s snipers, heartbeat sensor, hybrid sight, hammer scope, shotgun, holographic sight, extended mags, thermal scope, and variable scope. The frag, Semtex, throwing knives, bouncing beddies, yes, I love those, claymores and C4s are lethal, Fla uh, tactical flash screen, concussion, scrambler, EMP grenade, smoke grenade, trophy system, tack insert, portable radar, and our weapon camouflages are blue tiger, red tiger, fall, digital, woodland, arctic, desert, coal, gold, it's not there, but I know it's going to re return. Um, and for the miscellaneous, we are knife, I love, riot shield, I uber love, <clears throat> and uh, nine bang, which I think is overpowered, termites, and the M134 minigun. Um, that's it, guys. Uh, thanks for watching. And uh, comment and subscribe if you want to. After this uh, black screen, you will see the um, picture of this of my this uh, kid that I I said I was cool with him, but I don't know what to do with the picture. Maybe you guys can uh, give me some uh, some things to do, like uh, turn in the cops or whatever. So thanks for watching. Uh, comment and subscribe.
Peace, and here is the picture of him. Enjoy. See ya.